Hey guys, today I'm here with a video about pop sockets. I'm going to actually show you just how easy it is to design your own custom pop socket. So why don't we just go ahead and jump in. First you want to go to their website, popsockets.com, and then you want to click on design your own. Once you're on the design your own landing page, you're going to do just very simple steps. So in this case, you want to go ahead and upload a picture either from your device, from your Facebook page, or your Instagram. Just keep in mind that if you're doing anything on Facebook or Instagram, you will have to give them authority to go into your account and pull those pictures in. So if you're kind of leery about security, you may want to avoid these options, but if anything, I'm going to go ahead and keep this process simple and pull a, a photo from a Vegas landscape. And since I live here in Las Vegas, one of the things that we've been obviously affected by is just this whole tragedy. And I'm going to make a hashtag Vegas strong pop socket. So with that, I've got the landscape that I want. You can make adjustments using the, the bars to the left and the right. So if you want to scroll in or view out or view more in, you can certainly do that and play around with kind of the settings here. You're able to twist the photo. So I want to get this back to this, this layout. And then I want to maybe... Let's just expand it, assuming that the quality here is good. So once you've got the picture kind of laid out on the pop socket, you do have the option to add text to this. So I'm going to put hashtag Las Vegas or Vegas strong. Sorry, not Las Vegas strong. Vegas strong. Um, so as you can see here, it's not exactly perfect in terms of where I want the, the, the font and the, the text. So you can actually change this stuff around. Um, I can do inline. I actually personally like the, the circle effect that it's providing. And I'm going to actually change the font type to, let's do party. So let's just say I'm happy with this. I'll click OK. You can also change the color of the text, but in this case, I'm going to keep it, um, I'll keep it black for now. So once you've got everything that you want laid out, you simply um, choose your next step, which would be step color. And you can choose the accordion type. You can do their standard, their black or their white accordion. And personally, I just choose black just because the, the white one does get pretty pretty dirty. Um, once you've done that, you've selected your accordion. I'm going to go ahead and hit preview. Um, once you add your item to the card, it can no longer be customized. So I'm, I'm good in all fronts there. So I'm going to click OK. It's uploading, processing, and it gives you kind of, again, a, a one-time opportunity to kind of preview your design. So I'm good with the design. Let me go ahead and add this to cart. And once you do that, that's pretty much it. As you can see here, the pop socket, when you do a custom piece, it retails for about $15. Um, let me go ahead and hit checkout. I'm gonna hit no thanks to this for now. Um, so once you do, do that, that's pretty much it. You can apply obviously any discount information that you may have um, and then fill out all your pertinent information. But as you can see, you can really do this in a few easy steps and have your own custom piece. I'll go ahead and link an actual custom pop socket that I did design that had hashtag Vegas strong um, just for you to see like a finished product um, once you do get it. Other than that, you guys have a wonderful day and I will catch you guys in the next video. Bye.